Hi, it's Brett from Niche Laboratory here, and here today I'm going to give a quick preview of a new tool that I'm building. Uh, this one is called Blog Spy. Uh, it's not finished yet, but it should be released by the end of February 2019. So this is a bit different from Niche Laboratory. It's more focused on finding blogs. And the whole thing is it will find lots of blogs related to your blog and the emphasis on finding blogs that you can outrank. So basically, if you put in a keyword, this job I put in niche websites and I've said that my website is nichepursuits.com. It's not really, but I'm just borrowing this niche to uh, try things out. So basically, if you put your website in, then it will find a whole load of blogs related to your blog. And uh, Niche Pursuits, obviously, it's Spencer Hawes' site. So I was imagining that that was my website. So it comes out here. So basically, it will colour blogs green if we can probably outrank them. Orange, we're quite close to the same ranking that they are. Uh, red, these are the uh, god level blogs. Uh, be very hard to compete with any of these. So as you can see, Niche Pursuits, you've probably seen the website, um, is quite popular, but it's kind of very small compared to something like uh, Smart Passive Income. Um, what the other ones and shout me loud. These are two gigantic marketing blogs. So what can you do with this information? Uh, this is very useful because you can find all of the green ones here. If we have a look at what content they're doing, we should probably be able to write very similar content and actually outrank them, especially if we can write better quality content than they have on their own website. So the niche will vary. It says that this niche is uh, quite not that popular with bloggers. Um, but I'll come on to that later. So as you see, it works better with older niches. Uh, niche pursuits is quite well established. So you see that there's quite a few blogs here that you should be able to easily compete with. So I was thinking that at the bottom here, things like uh, this one, six niche sites.com, any of these articles on here, you could probably rewrite them, put them on niche pursuits and they would outrank things. It's kind of sad, but that's the way things are going. It's just so competitive on the web nowadays. Um, if we scroll down, we can also see latest posts from some of the sites uh, so obviously if we're looking for ideas then this is a real at a glance thing for uh, here's some income reports i see lots of websites are doing these now so there should be some whole load of ideas here that uh, income school that Income School, they seem to have lots of episodes here. Maybe they're gone to video. Um, I'm doing quite well on YouTube, so uh, you should definitely consider YouTube. I don't think it's quite as saturated as the web is, especially for things like the keyword niches and related things. And so you can see there's an awful lot of articles. Um, here's our own website. Um, these ones are rather harder to compete with. So with the blog spy keyword tool here that if your blog is well established, then you'll probably find it a lot easier to find sites that you can actually like borrow their content ideas from and see if you can start out rank ranking them. Um, this comes from Niche Laboratory. I put it in there, which might be useful. Um, it shows a whole load of links. The other good thing about this blog spy tool is that you can get lots of ideas for articles because I don't know if you're blogging. Sometimes the hardest thing isn't getting ranked. It's actually coming up with ideas. So there'll be all kinds of ideas here. Uh, this as well, I'm looking for some other highly ranked search results. Um, 
So again, we can get more ideas from this. So this is a quick overview of the blog spy keyword tool. It's not quite finished. Um, I need to add on a few more blogs because uh, it's finding quite a lot of blogs now. Uh, one other thing is it gives a relevancy score here. I'll probably improve this a bit, but um, it's kind of working. See, this one is quite relevant. Um, niche pursuits, the keywords on the home page aren't actually that great, to be honest. So um, it's finding that it's finding that some of these are quite relevant, but Spencer should definitely uh, look at some of the content on his own page because it doesn't seem to be quite as relevant to niche sites as it should be. So that's an overview of this keyword tool. It should be available quite soon. I want to add in some more features because uh, it'd be nice to have even more blogs here. Uh, it does also use the Moz API data, so you'll need an API key for that, but you can have a free one, which uh, it just makes it much easier to work out which sites have a very high page rank and which don't. Okay, so I'm going back to coding to try and finish this off. But definitely look at the niche laboratory website to say this keyword tool should be available quite soon. Thanks for watching.